tinted and turned to gold Might as hands, but we all grow old Can't have my soul, let my heart turn stone Guess I gotta say it twice, it ain't my fault Every little thing got a price, that's what I thought That's what they taught yeah, I'ma take my chance to lie You know this ain't Good morning, you guys. Welcome back to a new vlog. I am getting ready to do these face brow and razor set thing. I haven't done it in a while, so I figured I'm just gonna do it real fast because I'm getting ready to head out of town later today. Actually, out of state, too. And I just figured, why not do it? Today is Thursday, August 25th. It is 8.47. My honey is playing with her toy. Ooh. This is what they look like. They're just like little razor things and you just slide it on your face and it like exfoliates it and like removes any hairs. I just washed my face, so you don't have to do it on a clean face, but I'm just gonna start. Ow, that kind of hurts. <laughs> So you just use it in like a downward direction. You want to go with, like with the way that your hair grows. Just work in like small little motions and it removes dead skin, it removes hair. It just exfoliates your face. And after I do this, my skin always feels so soft, especially like when I'm wearing makeup and stuff. It did kind of hurt where like I had longer hair like on my sideburns and like my mustache and stuff. But other than that, it wasn't bad at all. And yeah, I love doing these. I need to do them more often. I just always forget, but it does leave your face a little Red, but it looks so much better afterwards and then after you just want to put like some moisturizer on you'll be all good to go but anyway me and my brother are heading out of state today our whole road trip is gonna be 10 hours but we're only doing a little bit today today we're going to stay with my friend who just had a baby and has also like two other kids so i'm excited to meet a new little baby and then tomorrow morning we're gonna get up early and we're traveling to my brother just texted me. Then we're getting up early tomorrow morning and we're gonna drive to North Dakota because I talked about this on my channel a few months back, but one of my friends that used to live here, they just moved to North Dakota and it's her son's first birthday this weekend. So we're going up there to surprise her and yeah, just hang out for the weekend and have a good time. I've literally never been to North Dakota before. So this is gonna be something new, but it should be fun. Hopefully everything works out. We surprise her and we have a good trip. So yeah, that's what I'm doing this morning. I'm getting around, getting ready for a little travel day. Our travel today is only like four hours, four and a half, and then tomorrow we have six hours. And then on Sunday, we're making the whole like 10 hour trip back. Oh so yeah, it's gonna be a busy weekend. But the other day, let's see, what is today? Today's Thursday. So Tuesday, I started my fall clean and decorate with me video. I was gonna finish it yesterday, but I just did not get I didn't get to it. After work, I had the biggest freaking headache. And so I laid on the couch and Jared and I took a nap and we didn't get up until six o'clock. And then after that, I made some quesadillas for dinner and then we watched the, an episode of Big Brother and went to bed. So I need to finish that video this morning before we leave, which shouldn't take that long because all I have to do is like put every, all the decor out and stuff. Oh, I forgot. I was gonna start like hacking my makeup as I'm doing it too. Okay guys, I'm literally picking the vlog back up where I just ended the last one. I ended that video like two seconds ago, <laughs> right back into this one. But I just showed you in the last video, but I wanna show you again. These new cups that I got from Amazon are literally so cute. Don't judge me Carly for saying cute. They're like double glass wall cups. I had hot coffee in it and it wasn't hot to hold. Like typically if I have hot coffee, my cup is like really hot, but I don't feel like this was hot on my hand to hold. I'm obsessed with them. I love the handles and if you watch, you know, other vloggers, I'm sure you've seen these before. They're just so cute and aesthetic and I think work great for fall because fall and winter is really the only times that I like drink hot coffee. So I really wouldn't put like iced coffee in this. I would only drink this with like tea and hot coffee. So that's why it's fall vibes. Yeah, I just got done decorating my house for fall and I'm waiting on my brother to get back. I slept with my hair in braids last night or a braid last night. Excuse you. Jeez. And it was like wavy and stuff, but now it's kind of like 
limp. So I think I'm gonna go crimp my hair real fast because if I crimp it, then it should be good to go for like the entire weekend. And then we're gonna go stop and see my grandma get a coffee somewhere, even though I'm literally just drinking a coffee now. I want Duncan and be on our little merry way, I think. I'm sad, I don't wanna leave the dogs. I know they're only not gonna have a parent here for a day and a half because by the time we leave, it'll only be like a half a day left. And then all day tomorrow, I won't be here and Jared won't be here, he's at work. So the neighbors are gonna like come let them out and stuff. And then Jared will be here Saturday morning. So it's literally only like half a today and all day tomorrow. And then they'll be back to like having one parent home, but it still makes me so sad. I don't want to leave them. This is the first time that I'm leaving Honey. Cause if we've traveled anywhere, we've taken her with us and I've never left her. It's making me sad. It's like, she's my child. <laughs> Like she will be eight months, let's see, eight months on Tuesday? It's not like the 30th. She'll be eight months on the 30th. I feel like that's around the time where maybe you might leave your child overnight for the first time. So it's literally like she's my child. Granger, we've left him home many a times because he's such a good boy. I'm gonna try and leave Honey out for a little bit. Cause I don't want them to be in their kennel, you know, the whole time. So maybe every other time that the neighbor comes over and lets them out, they can put them in the kennel and then the next time just leave them out for a bit and then put them in the kennel. But I'm just kind of nervous because Honey, she doesn't eat things. She just steals stuff like off the table and then we'll just like leave it on the floor. So like I'm closing all the doors so she can't get into any of the rooms. And I don't really think she can get anything. The worst she can get off the table is like a tablecloth. I am kind of worried about my flowers because she did attempt to eat my flowers the first time they were up here. So hopefully she just doesn't touch those, but it'll be fine. Everything's fine. I'm I'm fine. Honey wants to show you guys her favorite thing to do. Sister, come here. Ow! Chill, dude. Okay. Ready? <laughs> One, two, three. <laughs> it's the jump for me. She loves to be held like a little baby. Huh? Your mom's little baby. Your mom's little baby. Say hi. Hey. Oh, God. You're so spoiled. You're so spoiled. But my brother's here, we're just getting ready to head out. I'm gonna have to leave my babies. <laughs> get in your kennel. They get an unhealthy gross treat that I just got from Miller General Fast. You, you get in your kennel, ma'am. The treat is coming, get in your kennel. All right, there you go. I won't see you again until Sunday, I'm so sad. I'm so sad, bubbles. You guys lay down, I love you. Aww. So my brother wanted firehouse subs. So that's what we got. And we were going to get Duncan, but a new place just opened up down here. It's called Dutch Bros. We're gonna try that out since neither one of us have had it. Samantha Jo, love her. She is obsessed with Dutch Bros. And so I'm kind of excited to try it. She raves about some sort of like cookie dough coffee. So it sounds weird, but I'm gonna try it. That's her go-to. So we got our cookie dough cold brew thing. It looks pretty cute. Mm. Well, my stomach also tasted it. <laughs> they said they put chocolate milk in here. I don't even feel like it tastes like coffee. <laughs> I mean, yeah. It's good, I don't want to say it's bad. Yeah, it's good, it just definitely doesn't, I don't get coffee from it, but what does it taste like? I don't even know what it tastes like. Bitter chocolate milk. Yeah, it's good though. I like it, but there's a giant piece of ice right where my hole is, so I can't hardly get anything. Not too shabby. The cold film was good by itself. Her eyes open. She's not sleeping yet. They're just barely open. I know. It's like I can see a little bit. <laughs> Walk into the place, dispatch you from a race. My heart, it started racing. What do you mean? <laughs> you got a cookie? Oh, you're quiet now?
morning, you guys. We're in South Dakota. I've never been this far north before. It's 10.35. We have about two and a half hours left. We're gonna get there at 1.02. We got up at 5 a.m. this morning and left at 5.30. Had about a seven hour drive, so it actually hasn't been that bad, I don't feel like. It's been a fairly nice drive. I'm getting kinda hungry, need some food. Oh, I was like, shit, did I not drink my Starbucks with that yours? No, that's yours, I drink all of mine. I drink all of mine. This is mine. Oh, it is mine. <laughs> I thought I drank all of mine. It doesn't taste too bad. But actually, both of them say strong because you can't drink. Oh, yeah. But my stomach is growling. And we just talked to Cam, which is Marie's husband, who we are surprising. And he said that she's at home baking for the birthday party tomorrow. Did I even tell you guys it's her son's first birthday? That's why we're going up to surprise her. And if she doesn't cry, we're turning around and leaving. But we just found out that her parents are there too, so I'm pretty sure her mom is gonna ball. I think she's gonna be super shocked. We um, tried to stop in Sioux Falls to get a birthday present, but we missed our exits with shopping centers, so we didn't get to stop, but now, there's a town coming up that should have something in it. I don't want to stop there. I'm going to do it. Well, I'm not, we don't have to stop there. I just want to stop and get something to eat. Because um, I'm, I'm hungry. Yeah. Which I think is about in like 20 or 15 minutes or something. All I had this morning was a coffee cake. And a hash brown from McDonald's. Grandma said, oh, be careful. I love you too so much. <laughs> love you too. Love you too. Okay, you guys, I forgot to tell you the freaking funniest story. <laughs> so last night we stayed at my friend Morgan's house and she has three kids and the two older ones were pretty much showing off for us. They went to bed last night, we were there and then when they got up this morning we were gone and Morgan texted me and was like, Wade, which is her four year old son, she goes, Wade just woke up. And then she goes, Wade said, mommy, where are your friends? And Morgan said, they had to leave. And Wade was like, but why? And Morgan was like, they had to go to another friend's house, but Chanel will be back in just two weeks. Wade goes, oh, so is her dad still here? <laughs> they thought Jalen was my dad. Morgan goes, no, he's not, but that was her brother. <laughs> I've been laughing about that all morning. It's so funny. Oh my God, I love kids. We finally made it! Look how pretty it is in North Dakota. So they are apparently eating at a restaurant. We've been like talking to Cam. He's at work today and he's like giving us her location and everything. But we are here and we're just gonna go inside, maybe get us a beer or something, sit on the back patio and enjoy a little drink and wait on them. This is gonna be so epic. Well, first order of operation. Oh, there's the thing. literally beautiful it sounds like a fall evening here because of the grasshoppers it really does what is the degrees do you think 74 i just looked oh you did 74 degrees at like two o'clock <laughs> we're just waiting for her to come around the corner when in time she's like three minutes away we're getting nervous <laughs> Good. Oh, we surprised you. Good. Oh, 
Right, no, not even that. We've not had a that. beer. We've had a beer on the pole porch. Yeah, we drink oh the beer. Gosh, okay. guys. Hi. Hi. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> Hi. Good morning, y'all. We are in our hotel room, about to get ready for the day. It's Saturday, August 27th, 8.01 a.m., which it is also game day. Today officially starts Husker football season, and I'm so pumped. They are playing in Ireland today, which is insane. Oh my god, what the heck is that? <laughs> yeah, nonetheless, we're so excited for game day. Go Big Red. But just about to get ready in my glamorous little makeup setup. <laughs> The lighting in here is awful, so I'm like trying to use the natural light from the window, but my mirror's right here, so yeah, just, just bear with me. I don't even know what all I vlogged yesterday. I feel like I didn't vlog much, which is expected because busy, you know, spending time with my friend that I traveled 11 hours to see. We played Skipbo shortly after we got there, and your girl won the first game. Holla! And then we just kind of hung around for a bit. We went and got dinner and ice cream, and then we also had to drive like an hour to go pick up her brother from the airport, which means that my brother and I were in the car for even longer, but it was okay because we literally drove up here to spend time with them and whatever they were doing, we were gonna spend, we we're gonna do it with them. So yeah, we picked up her brother at like nine o'clock at the airport and then we drove back to their house and turned around and drove back 30 minutes in the direction that we had just come to come to our hotel room. This morning, I think we're just going to get ready. My brother's in the shower right now. I already took a shower. We're like literally this freaking close to Minnesota. So we're just gonna walk over that way to get coffee and we're gonna go to Minnesota. So we're gonna hit like, you know, so many states this weekend, which is so fun because we've never been to a lot of them. And then once we get coffee, we'll probably also get a little something to eat, head back over to Marie's house, do whatever help she needs because her son's birthday party is today at one. So we'll get ready for that and stuff. But yeah, just another fun day in North Dakota. Minnesota but it looked longer than what I thought it was gonna be and we were just gonna walk because we wanted to like take a picture in front of like the Minnesota sign or something like that but there really wasn't even a sign so we just drove to Minnesota did a few blocks and then we came back to North Dakota we stopped at Walmart and got a birthday present and now we're heading back to Marie's party is at 1 game is at 11 30 we'll probably head and start decorating and stuff like that but just wanted to give you guys a little update
look a little messy. You look a little messy. <laughs> <laughs>